everybody. Okay, we're on. So when people get on, they'll be able to see us. And we're gonna do Killian's makeup today. Maybe I'll put you back here, and then I'll move some things forward. So if you're just joining us, we just started. We haven't even officially started yet, but we're gonna do some pop art makeup today. And my cutie pie is gonna let me make him look like a comic book character, and I'm super excited. Um, let me share the video real quick so I can get anybody else in here to let's see if I can figure out how to share a video hey Colleen how are you I don't know how to share my own video what am I doing oh man nope I got nothing I don't know how to share super strange there it is there's the share option sorry we're we're getting to it we are share just share. Let's share it on my personal page. Maybe. Share on my timeline. Hopefully that works. Okay. So, here's what we're going to do. I've got a picture that Killian really liked. And we're going to do his makeup. To make him look like a comic book character. And it's going to be absolutely hilarious. Because he's a little blondie. And we're going to like cover his little hairline. And make him look amazing. So if you're gonna do this to your kiddo, you probably are aware that they already have perfect skin. If you're doing this to your, oh no, look at you got a little, you're breaking out a little bit. Yeah, yeah. so much look in your lips. Um, so we, uh, we're gonna lighten his skin tone a little, then we're gonna darken it and contour it, and then we're gonna put black lines on it and you can put red dots or white dots or whatever kind of comic you look you want to do too and I'm not exactly sure what we're gonna do today Auntie Colleen says hi but we're gonna find out so I'm gonna put the lightest color that I got in my makeup collection on Killian's face and it's you know the same color as his skin so you can see it a little bit we're gonna dab that around, make him look so handsome. And it's Halloween, so we're gonna just do it all up, right buddy? It doesn't have to be your normal, thin, beautiful coat of makeup. And he's like, he asked me for this, so I'm not torturing him. He really wanted me to do his makeup, didn't you buddy? Spread that around. You doing good? Okay, and then I'll use my little blender and get it in there. Real nice. Doesn't he look nice and white and fresh and white as a ghost? Let me turn this up a little bit. Hopefully that helps a little. Scoot in there. So you'll be able to see the colors as we go. It's usually this spot gives me some super great daylight, but not today, so I've got my ring light on. Hopefully that that's okay for the video. Okay, very handsome. Is it itchy? You gotta pick your nose? No? Okay, good. We don't wanna do that. Not on video. You got stinky feet though. Pew. I can smell them from over here. Okay, so then I'm gonna use a small brush because he has a small face. And I'm gonna go in with a nice dark contour color. And I'm gonna do, will you look at me for a minute so they can see me do this? With this line here and then down here and this is gonna make his face look nice and skinny we'll blend it out in a little bit but also it's a comic book character so it doesn't have to be blended out real great right bud and we're gonna go down here now i haven't practiced this this is a picture we found on the internet that Killian really liked. And we're just trying to do our best with the skills that we have. Huh, buddy? So take what you can and make adaptions the way you want to. Look this way. If I can do your chin. 
And we're gonna kind of chisel his chin in a little, make him look like a grown up. Now you look like you have a beard. <laughs> um, where else should we shade? We're gonna shade kind of right around here. Might need a thinner brush right over here. Looking good. And then we're gonna do all up here. And this is gonna be much darker than this, but we'll just give ourselves a little uh, base to start. Right, bud? Let's see how this hairline should go. Should go straight here and over and up. We wanna really see where the hair is because on a comic book character, you really see where the separation of the hairline is. So, do the same thing over here. Looking good, looking good. Okay. Alrighty. So boys are easy. I feel like girls, we have to, we're gonna have to like do some blush maybe and make them look beautiful and probably line their eyes. But since Killian is just a little boy, it's gonna be super simple. I'm gonna go in with a dark black. Now if you have like a liquid liner, you can definitely use that. Or you can do what I'm gonna do. And we are going to just kind of make a hairline here. down. Why don't you look that way so they can see a little bit. And we're going to trace it down and around the side and give them some nice little sideburn here. How do we like that? Looks pretty good. I'm going to color that in. Probably be easier to do that with a bigger brush. I'm going to color it in with my multitasker. So if you don't know what you're doing for your kid, just turn him into a comic book character, right buddy? Although Killian's going to be Dash, so he has a costume, however. We want to do something fun online today. handsome. Okay, let's do this side so they can see. Look at mommy. Can you look at mommy? Let's look this way a little bit. Here we go. I'm going to color this in up here. Such a nice hairline. Look at mama. There you go. I'm going to block <laughs> this in. And we're going to draw your sideburns. And we're going to color it in a wee bit. So hard to see. Sorry if my head is blocking you guys. What are you doing over there? Gross dogs. They sound gross, don't they? Nasty. Okay, let's just try to make this look a little even. because your hair is so blunt. That's what makes it so good. Now what you could do, if you were gonna do this for real Halloween, is um, get like a mascara, like a hair wand, like a, it looks like a mascara brush, and put some uh, streaks in your hair too, so it looks very comic-y. Um, and let me see. We are gonna... Just, let's see, we're going to give you some cool eyebrows, some nice thick comic book eyebrows, which are usually, let's see, we go, this will be hard to take off, but you're going to look funny. 
Can you look at mommy? Do you want to be a happy comic book character or a grumpy comic book character? Grumpy. Grumpy? Can you look at me? I'm going to bring these up nice and high. You gonna wear this when we pick up Magnus from school? No? <laughs> These just look like yours. No, you think your eyebrows? He thinks his eyebrows look like mine. What do you think? Grumpy. Does that mean I look grumpy? Because I try to make you look grumpy. No? Yeah? Still, you gotta look at me because I can't really see. We're trying to give you some nice, big. Bushy eyebrows. Because comic book characters have very pronounced eyebrows. Right? I don't know. Is there a difference between like pop art and comic books? Who knows? I'm not in that nerdy realm anymore. So I don't know, but we like this. It's funny. You're looking hilarious. Okay, then we want to make sure we do some like expression lines on the face. So I'm going to use this skinny side of my brush and I'm going to give Killian some little scowl lines since he wants to look grumpy. It's not to... Hold on. need a skinnier brush than that apparently. Like a nice stiff brush. So I'm going to go like this and this. In there okay then we're gonna make sure we know he has a nice nose so we're gonna put a line right down the side comic book characters you can always see their noses and then we're gonna line the outside of the nose right here and right here looking good huh okay and let's see where else do we need lines <laughs> Should we do your lips, buddy? Do your cheeks? So there's a couple different ways to do the cheeks. You could line this contour, which I forgot to blend out. So let me do that real quick. Just gonna. We want it to be there, but we don't want it to be a harsh line. We want to make the line with the black color. Okay, look at mommy again. Okay. Looking. Hilarious. Gwen says he looks weird. Gwen and said you look weird. So we can do kind of like this with his cheeks, or we can do this like, let's see, let's do one line here. There we go. And then on the other side, look at mommy. We're gonna go here. Yep. Yeah. And we're gonna, um, let me see you again. This way, look at mama. Just kind of blend this line out a little bit. You got an itch? Get itch it, it's okay. Um, and we're gonna do his lips. You ready, buddy? Now. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Let me turn that off. He looks pretty good, if I say so myself. What color lips should you have? Um, just like white lips? I don't know, what kind of color lips do comic book dudes have? Mm -hmm. I think they're white, they're just lined. And yeah. he has those kind of lips. Oh, you think they have glossy lips? He wants lip gloss. Let's just keep doing the black and then we'll decide at the end, okay? So we're going to make this nice and dark. There we go. Okay, then we want to make sure we know he has a chin. Because comic book guys have very pronounced features. So, we're going to go right here. Boop. How's that? Look at mommy. It's hard to make a nice straight line when you're a, or a curved line. 
There we go. I think that's pretty good. Then we're gonna do, um, thanks Lene, yeah, he looks hilarious. He looks a little bit more grown up than usual, which is funny to me. Okay, where should we put the next line? No, up there? So like, like a, like a, maybe you got like a stray hair, like right here. Ha, ah, that looks good, that's a good idea, buddy. Okay, and then we're gonna do his jaw and make sure his jaw looks real masculine because, you know, comic book characters, right? So I want you to like tip your head this, that's close to what I was thinking. But So we're gonna go right up here. Let's see, chin down. <laughs> you can look down, now look that way so they can see. Look like that way, there. What do you think? I think that's pretty good. All right, now let me see the other side. Look this way. And we're gonna follow that, okay. I think I like it. <laughs> okay, um, but let's do under here too. So maybe we'll give you a little hilarious little chin. What do you think about that? Like it? I shouldn't ask you that because now you're moving your head. There we go. Like, put your chin down. Let's see. All right, I'm going to take this off. That looks silly. We don't want to look silly. We don't want to look amazing. Perfect. All right. I'm going to go back with the lightest color in my palette. And I'm going to lighten his lips a little bit. Because you can see how beautiful and pink little boy lips are. And as fun as that is, right, buddy? We want to look like not that those picture. Ones. No, not that, that, that one. Not the contours. We're going to use the light color. And actually, maybe I'll do it with my big brush because it'll be faster. <laughs> oh, it's killing me. All right. So I'm going to use, oh man. Okay. Some moonlit. Let me see. Uh, I'm going to put this on here. Can you show me your lips? I think I put them out, not put them in. Okay, just look regular. Can you smile? That's true. So one thing to remember about any time you do any makeup, whether it's your own or it's uh, on your child for Halloween or face paint at a party, is you should always do the color before you do the black because you don't want the black to spread onto the, the color. Okay, don't do that. Just look at them. Okay. <laughs> Pretty good. Try not to get on your teeth. Okay, that's good. That looks that looks nice. That looks really nice. All right. Um, and we're gonna do right underneath your eyeballs, cause you need your eyes to look real pronounced. So we're gonna do. Well, you're grumpy, right? You're grumpy, comic book characters. So if we're gonna go grumpy. What should we do for grumpy? This guy's not grumpy. Let's see, is this guy grumpy? Oh, uh, okay. We'll just make up our own grumpy eyeballs. So we're gonna go, instead of going like smiley, maybe we're gonna go like, that. But you're smiling, you're supposed to look grumpy. Like, to put my finger right here. Hard to make a straight line. Let me see. Let me take this part off. You okay? Did your back hurt? Getting too old for this sitting around business? Let's see. They look in there. That looks pretty good. Um, probably don't want to get it too close to your eyes because you're so little, but will you close your eyes for me? And I'm going to trace right up here in your eyeball. Get those big comic book eyes. There we go. Now look in there again. Let's see it. I think that looks pretty nice. Okay. What do you think, buddy? Alright, so one of the last things I want to do, I'm going to use, hopefully this works, I'm going to use my eyeshadow brush and a red scarlet. I'm going to have to get a good amount on there to really make it look 
nice and red. And I'm gonna put some dots, right? Okay, so I want you to look a little bit this way. That's looking good. Can you look this way again? Thanks, babe. Hopefully it doesn't look like he has the chicken box when we're done here. He trying to look like a comic book character, right? Look at my. I'm going to bring this up here. And that was just my finger in your ear, don't worry. I don't know if there's like usually some sort of technique to, you know, look this way. Um, where you put the red dots on pop art, but, you know, we're just trying to make it work the best that we can here. So we won't put it in the hairline. So I'm guessing that's not usual way to do it. Don't touch What are you looking at? Let me see it. I was putting my hair up. Okay. Get one. I'm gonna go here. 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 So handsome. So serious. How's he look? Pop party? I think we're all done. Mm -mm. I think we are done. I mean, I could trace your nostrils a little bit. We want to get real technical here. Um, can, we, can we do that one? You want some lipstick? Let's see. Let's go right here. Yeah, that looks good. What do you think, bud? I think to the other one. Now you can't pick your nose. Now you won't be able to pick your nose. Because you'll get makeup all over your finger and everybody will know. That looks so good. You're cutie pie. Now that one. Okay, now that one. Alright, let's see. You gotta let your kids pick some of their makeup out, huh? Okay, handsome. I don't think we missed anything. We've got the frowny line, the nose line, the cheek line. I think that's it. We got the hairline. What you could do if your kid likes to part too is you could, uh, you know, if you get their hair cut, like when I cut my boy's hair, sometimes I give them like a nice hard, hard part with like a razor. You could take the black and do like a nice black line in there too. You want to do your hair? You're going to wear this to school when we pick up, pick up Magnus? Because this won't come out of your hair today. We'll have to wash it out. Mm -hmm. Yeah? So let's see if this works at all. Can you look down? So we'll draw some black comic-y lines in the hair. We'll have to give you a nice bath tonight, huh? Nice little bath. Daddy will be like, what the heck have you done to my children? Oh, bud. It's going to be kind of funny. And you can get some, like, uh, there, look that way. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, now look at me again. And we'll do across the front. You can get, like, a spray or that mascara wand I was telling you about and just kind of comb it through. This is kind of cool because you know it'll come out. I've had those sprays before, and even though they're supposed to come out, they don't. Can you look that way for me? But you also have to hope, you know, I mean, same with face paint, really, that your kids aren't, like, just going to touch it and get it everywhere all day or lay down <laughs> on the couch and ruin everything. I know that's going to happen. I just thought of that. Okay, let's see. What do you think? I'm gonna have to get him in here. 
Look at that. You look so good. You look so good. Maybe what? I don't. You need some more black lines over there? We could do that. Alright, let's see. So can you smile a little bit? There we go. Mom, okay, let's see. Um, why can't you do that quarter? Honey, that's not really a color that we need today. I do. Why. Bye, okay, Mom. we're all done. Can you say bye? Say bye, friends. Do you want to watch a movie? Do you want to go watch a movie? In my room. You're going to have to wash your hair. Or you're going to have to sit up so you don't lay on anything. Okay. We'll spray you with stay spray, then maybe it won't spread everywhere. Should I spray you? Okay, ready? Close your eye. Close your eye. Just actually close both your eyes. I'll tell you when open, okay? I'm about to spray. <laughs> okay, now we're officially out of here. Can you say bye to all the people who watched us? Say happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Can you say it louder? Happy Halloween. Wah ha ha ha.